part of our Remarkable Women series, this week's woman in the spotlight has been married for 54 years, completed her doctorate of psychology at the age of 66, and survived cancer. And that's just a snippet of what she's accomplished in her life. But Patricia Williams is just getting started. These days, the great grandmother's focus is on helping families in children's court. And she has a very special way of focusing on the positive. I really do think I have a big part. I think people might think I'm kind of easy. Patricia Williams, also known as Dr. Pat, believes in the power of peace and kindness. I always sympathize with the other person. That's always been my character. Growing up one of 11 siblings, she tells me she has always played the role of mediator of her family, hoping to quell any conflict, even as a very young child. My name is Mediator Pat. Fast forward nearly seven decades, Dr. Pat now volunteers much of her time advocating for children and families in LA County's dependency court through the nonprofit Southern California Family Mediation. As a mediator, I'm allowing people to be able to express their feelings that they probably felt that they couldn't do it in any other avenue. In this time where, you know, we're so polarized and we're so divisive, um, she's teaching us how to be peacemakers. Attorney and fellow mediator Cindy Wynn nominated Dr. Pat as a remarkable woman because of her courage and inspirational spirit. So how does Dr. Pat lead by example? Um, every morning we have a pre-mediation meeting and she just comes in with so much joy. Keeping that positive attitude is a way Dr. Pat deals with her pain of losing two of her children at a young age. It also helped her when she was diagnosed with breast cancer just four years ago. I know when the doctor first told me that I had cancer, um, he didn't want to say the C word. And he said, it's not good. I said, well, I'm not going to cry because God is going to be the one to make that decision. Now cancer free, this great grandmother isn't slowing down anytime soon. She knows there is still a lot of work to do. And that's just one of the reasons we are recognizing her as a remarkable woman. My kids tell me, Mom, you always giving, you always doing. I said, guess what? It's from my heart. We have been highlighting a remarkable woman every Tuesday in March. And if you've missed any of their stories, you can tune in to the special airing on April 11th at 7 p.m. right here on KTLA.